hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel i'm linda so in today's video we just want to set up the kamkunji dish rack it is a three tire dish rack as you'll see in the video and also i just want to do a quick wash of the storage containers that we got at kamkunji so guys if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing and let's enjoy the video hello guys and welcome back to my channel i'm linda so as i had promised uh, we are going to set up the kamkunji stuff together and today i just want to set up the new rack and also to wash the utensils and keep them and wash the pantry stuff so i will start with the rack and uh, then go to the things that we bought in kamkunji and guys special request please subscribe to my channel if you come across this channel uh, today or any other day please just consider subscribing so these are the stuff that we are supposed to wash and set up they are still in the box i just returned them in the box after unboxing and this is the dish rack it's a three tire dish rack so we'll set this up together i hope i don't blunder too much because it doesn't have a manual but we'll see how it turns out so this is the rack we'll just remove it from the box place the box aside and uh, open it up so it comes with this stuff i hope i'll figure it out how to fix it because I have no clue, I have no idea. going to open this up <laughs> oh my god actually guys it has come with a manual in poor kondani kabisa so yeah i'm trying to follow the steps and uh I think it dictates that we do this. We start up with this stand. I don't know what to call them, but these two stand things. So here guys I got some help because this thing needed two people to set it like one to hold one side and the other one to hold the other side as you put in the screws.
So this is the final look after finishing setting it up and it it wasn't that hard. You just follow the directions on the manual. So after setting up the rack and making sure it's perfectly set, I went on to now cleaning the storage containers and I just uh, disassembled them before cleaning them. I also washed the glasses, uh, the oil jars and uh, so on and so forth.
So guys, if you know me in person, you'll know that I don't like washing utensils. But uh, this thing that you put on the top, the flosset thing, it made washing the utensils so enjoy enjoyable. And the water was coming out in such a cool way. And it was just uh, like, what, what can I say? It was just relaxing and stress relieving. Walking alone, the streets are empty The only thing I can see is my own silhouette I'm getting stronger, step by step The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me I've been flying from town to town From London to Taiwan I've been all around the globe Trying to protect your soul So guys, here I'm done with the cleaning of the utensils, as in the pantry organization stuff and the glasses and whatever, whatever. And yeah, <laughs> confession, I didn't finish washing all of them. There are so many, I got tired. But this is what I washed and these are the results. Above the sky, we are heroes So after finishing with washing of the utensils, I went ahead to set up this thing that holds your tissue, kitchen tissue, or uh, clinging foil and aluminum foil. You just place it on the wall. But this one had screws. So I just had to use a glue gun to fix it on the wall, of which it will fall after three days. So I'll find a long-lasting solution for it. <laughs> Simon. 